We have more talk here of Russia and China kneecapping the petrodollar in 2018. This is coming from Saxo Bank. They're predicting that the world's largest crude oil importer, which is China, is likely to roll out the petro yuan next year. And they're saying that Russia is going to gladly accept this. They already have contracts in place. They say for them being the world's largest oil importer, many producer nations are already more than happy to transact in China's terms. This is interesting because we've talked about a shift to the east here on this world stage. If anything was to happen to the United States, a lights out situation, anything like that, it would, well, let's just say the stage is set for China to step up as the leader at that point in their currency as well, especially if the lights went out or the dollar collapsed or anything like that. That's where they're positioning themselves at the moment. But this is also interesting in terms of the numbers here. If you look at where their currency is sitting, it is set to appreciate 10% against the dollar. Not depreciate, appreciate. Taking the dollar yuan exchange rate below 6.0 for the first time ever. So here on the world stage, in terms of where they're taking this, I've talked about it before. It seems as though China, Russia, you know, full court press here. And as other countries jump on board, you're going to see others start jumping on board. And all it's going to take is a bunch of them to shift because for the longest time, the U.S. military has gone around to Iraq and Libya, all these other places to enforce use of their petrodollar. And even it threatened Japan at times in the, in the past here within the past uh, decade or so, especially when Japan was talking about doing deals with China. It was right after that they were struck with that massive quake. The dragon families are real, though, here on this world stage, and they don't just reside within China or within, within Asia. There's the European branch. There's many different branches. But here on this world stage, a shift away from the U.S. dollar to me Obviously, if something happens to the U.S. dollar, China has positioned itself to take over. But there's more information here at this link. I'm going to break this down in further detail this Friday night, Underground World News Live. Go into detail about the different countries here on this world stage and where this is all going, how everything is shaping up thus far. Bindabu 7, eyes open.